Hello, science fans. Today we're diving into a truly mind-bending cosmic question that might sound like science fiction, but is rooted in real astrophysics. Could a passing star actually push Earth out of its orbit? It's a scenario that's both thrilling and a little unsettling to imagine. Picture Earth peacefully circling the sun for billions of years. Our seasons, climate, and life all depend on this stability. This delicate balance is what makes life possible on our planet. But the universe is anything but static. Everything out there is in constant motion, and nothing stays the same forever. Stars, including our sun, are constantly moving through the Milky Way. Our solar system is actually traveling at incredible speeds, orbiting the center of our galaxy. Sometimes their paths bring them surprisingly close together, close enough for gravity to make a difference. These rare encounters can have dramatic effects. So what happens if a wandering star strays into our neighborhood? Could it disrupt the orbits of planets or even send some worlds flying into deep space? Could it really nudge Earth off course? The gravitational pull from a close passing star could, in theory, alter the paths of planets, including ours. This isn't just science fiction. Astronomers are running simulations to find out. Using powerful computers, they model what might happen if a star came too close. Our solar system feels stable, but it's part of a much bigger, ever-changing galactic dance. Over millions of years, even small changes can add up. Scientists are now asking, how fragile is our place in the cosmos? Could a cosmic encounter change everything we know? Let's dive into the latest research and see what could happen if a star comes too close. The answers might surprise you and they reveal just how dynamic our universe really is. Get ready to rethink our place in the universe. The cosmos is full of surprises. So let's explore what could happen if our planet's journey through space takes an unexpected turn. To understand how a star could disrupt us, let's talk about gravity, the invisible force that keeps our solar system together. Gravity is one of the fundamental forces of nature, and it's at work every second, everywhere in the universe. It's what causes apples to fall to the ground, and it's also what binds entire galaxies together. Without gravity, nothing would stay in place. Not the planets, not the stars, not even us. The sun's immense gravity acts as an anchor, pulling all the planets into stable orbits. It's the central force that keeps everything from drifting away into the cold emptiness of space. The sun's mass is so great that its gravitational pull extends far beyond the planets, even holding on to distant comets and asteroids. Imagine spinning a ball on a string. The sun is your hand, gravity is the string, and the ball is Earth. The faster you spin, the tighter the string pulls, just like gravity keeps Earth moving in its orbit. As long as the string holds, the ball keeps circling, just like our planet. If the string were to snap, the ball would fly off in a straight line. In the same way, if gravity suddenly disappeared, Earth and the other planets would shoot off into space, lost forever. Each planet has its own orbit, and for billions of years, this cosmic dance has been remarkably stable. The planets move in predictable paths, creating a rhythm that has lasted since the birth of our solar system. But every planet also has its own gravity, tugging on its neighbors. These gravitational interactions are like subtle nudges, sometimes speeding up or slowing down a planet's journey around the sun. Jupiter, the giant, gives the strongest nudges, shaping the orbits of other planets and even protecting Earth by deflecting comets and asteroids with its powerful gravity. But even Earth holds onto the moon, keeping it in orbit and creating the tides that shape our oceans. These pushes and pulls form a delicate balance, a cosmic web that keeps everything in check. It's a system of harmony, where every planet and moon plays its part. Our stable orbit puts us in the Goldilocks zone, not too hot, not too cold. This perfect distance from the sun allows life to thrive on Earth, making our planet unique in the solar system. But what if a massive new dancer, a passing star, entered the scene? Even a brief visit from another star could have dramatic consequences for our solar system. Its gravity could disrupt the balance, pulling planets off their paths, Orbits could stretch, shrink, or even break apart entirely, sending worlds careening into new, dangerous trajectories. The result? Chaos on the cosmic dance floor. Planets might collide, be flung into deep space, or spiral into the sun. Here's how that could unfold and why the balance of gravity is so crucial to the survival of our solar system. How do we know this is possible? Thanks to new research by astronomers Nathan Kybe and Sean Raymond. Using powerful computer simulations, they explored what happens if a star passes near our solar system over the next 5 billion years. Their findings? 
even a distant flyby could have long-lasting effects. The risk of a passing star causing chaos is higher than we thought. Still small, but not zero. A close encounter could nudge planetary orbits, making them unstable over millions of years. The process is slow, but the consequences could be dramatic. Their work, soon to be published in, reminds us that our solar system isn't isolated. We're part of a bustling galactic neighborhood with stars always on the move. This research peels back the layers of cosmic stability and reveals just how dynamic our universe really is. Let's see how a single nudge could set off a chain reaction. Imagine a star wandering just a little too close to our solar system. It wouldn't knock Earth away directly, but it could set off a chain reaction that would change everything we know about our cosmic neighborhood. The effects would be subtle at first, almost invisible, but the consequences could be catastrophic. The first domino to fall? Mercury, the smallest and most vulnerable planet, sitting closest to the Sun. Its tiny size and position make it especially sensitive to outside influences. Mercury's orbit is already wobbly, tugged and twisted by the immense gravity of both the Sun and the distant giant Jupiter. Even now, its path isn't perfectly stable. If a passing star came close enough, it could give Mercury just enough of a nudge to destabilize its delicate path, like flicking the first piece in a line of dominoes. Mercury's orbit might stretch out into a wild ellipse, or it could even be sent careening toward Venus, or spiral straight into the Sun. The possibilities are dramatic and dangerous. This sudden chaos would ripple through the inner solar system, disturbing the orbits of Venus, Earth, and Mars. The gravitational harmony that's kept our planets in line for billions of years would be thrown into disarray. The disappearance or collision of Mercury would alter the gravitational balance for all the planets, shifting the invisible forces that keep them on track. Suddenly, Earth and Mars could find their orbits shifting in unpredictable, even dangerous ways. Seasons could change, climates could shift, and life as we know it could be threatened. The stable paths we've relied on for billions of years could unravel, leaving the solar system in a state of chaos and uncertainty. It's a cosmic domino effect, one small push, and the whole system starts to wobble, each planet influencing the next in a cascade of instability. The gravitational web holding everything together would be torn, its threads snapping one by one as the planets drift from their familiar paths. Planets could drift onto new, dangerous paths. Some might even be ejected from the solar system entirely, lost to the darkness of interstellar space. And it all starts with a tiny nudge to Mercury, a small event that could unleash cosmic chaos on a scale we can barely imagine. If Mercury's chaos spreads, Earth could be in real trouble. Our orbit might become more elliptical, swinging us dangerously close to or far from the Sun. That means extreme heat or deep freeze. Either way, life as we know it would end. Worse, disturbed orbits could put us on a collision course with Venus or Mars. A planetary collision would obliterate Earth, vaporizing oceans and melting the crust. There's another possibility. If Earth drifts too close to Jupiter, its gravity could fling us out of the solar system entirely. We'd become a rogue planet, wandering the cold, dark galaxy alone. Cave and Raymond's simulations show this chain of events is possible, though unlikely. It's a sobering reminder of how interconnected and fragile our solar system really is. Gravity's power is immense, and a single event could change everything. While Earth's risk is low, Pluto faces a much higher chance of chaos. Pluto's orbit is tilted and elongated, making it especially vulnerable to a passing star's gravity. The new research shows Pluto is 20 times more likely than Earth to be ejected from the solar system in the next 5 billion years. A stellar nudge could send Pluto crashing into Neptune or Uranus, or slingshot it into interstellar space. The outer solar system is a dangerous place for small, distant worlds. Their orbits are less stable and more easily disrupted. Pluto's fate highlights how the solar system's edges are far more chaotic than its center. Studying Pluto helps scientists understand how planetary systems evolve and change. Even in our own backyard, some worlds live on the edge of stability. The risks out there remind us how special our own planet's stability really is. After all this talk of chaos, here's the good news, you don't need to panic. The odds of Earth being ejected from the solar system in the next 5 billion years are about 1 in 500. That's a tiny chance, stretched over a timescale longer than Earth's entire history. The kind of stellar encounter needed for disaster is extremely rare. 
Most stars pass far from our solar system, too distant to cause trouble. Our galactic neighborhood is, for the most part, quiet and safe. Scientists study these scenarios to understand the universe's rules, not because we're in imminent danger. It's about curiosity, not alarm. Knowing the possibilities helps us appreciate our place in the cosmos. Even with tiny odds, we're not just waiting for disaster. Astronomers are always watching the skies. Using powerful telescopes in space missions like Gaia, scientists map the positions and motions of billions of stars. If a star were heading our way, we'd spot it millions of years in advance. Unlike asteroids, stars move slowly on a galactic scale, giving us plenty of warning. Our current planetary defense focuses on asteroids, but future generations would have time to prepare for a stellar flyby. The key is detection, and our technology is improving every day. Projects like Gaia give us the data to predict potential threats with incredible accuracy. Astronomers are our cosmic lookouts, ensuring we know what's coming. Their vigilance keeps us safe and expands our understanding of the universe. So rest easy, the sky is being watched. What's the big takeaway? The universe is dynamic, sometimes chaotic, and always fascinating. Studying cosmic risks isn't about fear, it's about curiosity and discovery. Research like Cabe and Raymond's inspires new technology, new questions, and the next generation of explorers. It reminds us how rare and precious our stable, life-supporting planet truly is. Understanding the cosmos gives us perspective and a deeper appreciation for Earth. The real dangers we face are here and now, but learning about space helps us become better caretakers of our world. Exploration drives humanity forward, whether we're probing the oceans or the stars. Let's keep asking big questions and supporting the science that reveals our universe's secrets. The more we learn about the cosmos, the more we learn about ourselves. Thanks for joining this journey of discovery. Keep looking up.